derivation of sine rule equation and brat which stands for non right angle triangle that meant that none of these angles here have 90 degrees if I label that as A, and that meant this is angle capital A, and the opposite to angle capital A is the side here called little a. And if I label this one angle capital B, so that's the B, and the opposite to that little, the side opposite to the angle B is little b. And if this is capital little, capital C, and the opposite to that is little c. So, none of these angles, as I said, are 90 degrees. If I draw a line from up here to there, a perpendicular line to AB, So this line is perpendicular to AB, so therefore it's right angle. And this height here, height H, is the distance from this point to that point. Now to find, what I need to do is to find angle B, I'm going to use something called Sokatoa. So, ka for with Sokotoa, this is sine. Sine is opposite over hypotenuse. So my opposite here would be H. So I could write sine of angle B equals opposite H over hypotenuse. Hypotenuse is A. Now I can find H. That means I can make H the subject by multiplying both sides of this equation by A. That A will cancel that A. So H will become A sine of B. Likewise, I could find the angle A. For the angle A, I could do sine of angle A equals opposite, which is also H here, over hypotenuse, which is B. So that would be h over b at the same time i could multiply both sides by b to cancel that b out so i can get h equals b sine of a now i can see that h and h are both equal therefore a sine b will be equal to b sine a a sine of b will be equal to b sine of a. So what I can do now is write it here. I cannot do, this is a ratio now. So I can then say if I divide both sides by sine of a, I get a over sine of a sine of b equals b now if i then divide both sides by sine of b i then get a sine of a equals b over sine of b because if i divide that by sine b it will cancel out and then it will be also here or you can do something called cross multiply most people do that a lot so cross multiply so that sine a we go down sine b we go down so that's the cross multiply because this is over one, over one. So you could, yes, cross multiply sine B go there, sine A go there, and then. But this is the formula that we are looking for. And this formula is used to find the side. If you want to find the side in a non right angle triangle, it's best to use um, A, the side over the angle of A, equals side B over the angle of B. So to find sine A, just take sine, to find A, just take sine A to that side. 
So A will become B sine of A over sine of B. And also to find B, just take sine B over to that side. So B will become A sine of B over sine of A. So that's how to rearrange it to suit your need. The other way to write this equation is not to divide by sine of A and B, but rather to divide by B and A. So to do that, you could write, we know A sine B equals B sine A. So if we divide both sides by A and B, if I divide that by A first, I'll get sine B equals B sine A over A. And if I divide both sides by B, I'll start get sine B over B equals sine A over A. So that's another way of rearranging the equation to suit your need. And in this situation, this is A. In this situation, you can then make any of these the subjects. So if you want to find B, angle B, so you take B to the, to the other side. So sine of B equals B sine of A over little a. Therefore, B will be sine inverse of sine because you divide both sides by sine and in this is 1 over sine is sine to power minus 1. B sine of A over little a. Likewise, you could do the same by dividing, uh, by taking a to the other side. So for a, the angle, actual angle, because that's the sign of the angle, would be inverse sine, because you take a to the other side, it would be a sine of b over little b. And that's how you apply your the formula to suit your own need when solving any problem. So that's the derivation of sine rule equation for non right angle triangle because if it's a right angle triangle you can use Pythagoras and Sokotoa. But for non right angle triangle you cannot use Pythagoras and Sokotoa, you tend to want to use sine rule or cosine rule. You can still use Sokato and Pythagoras within the frame of solving a problem, but this is the relationship for non-right-angle triangle.